Alpha Reaper, baby. That is so cool. Oh, I can't wait to get one of these. But man, that is so cool. Alpha Crab that is tameable. What's up, guys? It's King Daddy D Mac, and welcome, welcome back to another episode of Ark Survival Evolved. That's right, playing here on the Poopin' Evolved Extinction Core server, baby! So excited to be here doing flips. Man, oh man. Guys, thank you for coming, hanging out, joining me on these adventures. As you always do, please remember, show that amazing support by slamming that thumbs up button. That's right, and if you're new to the channel, do not forget to subscribe for the daily arc awesomeness man oh man and speaking of awesomeness today i thought it might be kind of a cool day to come back and check on one of our old servers yes we've not played on this world for months and months i have to say but there was just a huge update done in extinction core and i wanted to check some of this stuff out it has to do with the new aberration update yes we now have Extinction Core and Alpha, Rock Drakes, Basilisk, Rapers, you name it. It, it. We've got it all. We've got it all. So I thought it might be kind of cool. Definitely not something I could cover all the updates in one episode, but I wanted to let you guys know very shortly, probably within the next week, I plan to be starting up a brand new Extinction Core series. That's right, starting from the beginning. I think it should be pretty cool. But I just, I wanted to see how things translated with the update, because it was a big one. Definitely, definitely a big one. I wanted to see if my old Extinction Core world would work. Of course, we used to have Four World Myth mod in this update, or in this pack, and that is no longer, so sad face there, but pretty cool. Um, I think the last time we were on, the last time we were on, I think the newest thing that we did is we got Primordius. Right? That's what that dude's name is? This crazy tech dragon? Dude, no. It's N Nephalum. Yeah, this dude, this dude right here. What an amazing, amazing creature. I always loved Extinction Core. It's got to be one of my favorites. If not my favorite. But so very cool. Anyway, first things that I noticed when I logged in on today. Um... All of our levels are gone. We still have them. We just, I gotta put them into my character. So it resets your character. Of course, I didn't lose any armor or anything. We have to unlock all the Ingrams again. Oh man. Oh man, so that's gonna take me a hot second. But fortunately, it looks like all the stuff that we had unlocked in the mod for Extinction Core prior did stay. So that's pretty cool. There's supposed to be a new Primordial Bean too. That's added in. So that's pretty exciting. We also have new tech armor and a new rail gun. That is super duper sweet. So I can't wait to see tons of new stuff added. Creatures that can generate all of the uh, aberration materials. So we don't necessarily have to play on aberration. So I thought this would be perfect. How's everybody doing though? It's been a while since I've come and hung out with you guys. Man, I missed you. I missed you so very much. And of course... All of our amazing tribesmen. Oh my goodness. So very cool. How have you guys been? You've been they've been holding down the fort. They've been holding down the fort for us. So very cool. We used to name instead of dinos, we'd name a new tribesman every episode. So pretty cool. Definitely pretty cool. Anyway, let me get all my stuff unlocked, all my levels put back into my character, and we'll see what we can find today. We'll see what we can do. At very least, I want to just highlight and check out some of the new stuff, so I think it should be awesome. All right, guys, and we are back. It's probably an hour later. I've been going through all the Ingrams. I've got all of my character levels boosted up how I want them, and there's a couple of Ingrams, a couple of them that I wanted to go through with you. Pretty cool. Notice, first of all, we can't unlock the tech stuff from Aberration yet because we haven't taken on the Aberration boss. There's probably going to be something in Extinction Core, some boss guy or just dino that we kill that will unlock it. Um, we also cannot unlock, it doesn't look like most, see it says learned on aberration. We can't unlock any of the aberration stuff. So hopefully that stuff unlocks again from killing something. But we do have, check it out, a roll rat saddle. Awesome. More aberration stuff. Carcano's saddle. Awesome. We can't do the S plus stuff till we do it on aberration or whatever. But there is an alpha ravager. Epic. Rock Drake, super sweet. 
Basilisk, very nice. Again, the tech stuff haven't un aren't able to unlock yet. But we do have Alpha Crab, the Alpha Carcanos, Alpha Rock Drake, Alpha Basilisk. It just goes on and on. So, so very cool. All things we can check out. There's also an Alpha Reaper, and there's also some primal uh, primal creatures. Those are like you know the lesser the lesser creatures. Um, you know, below alphas, below alphas, but above normal dinos. So pretty cool. And that's for the shine horn, the feather light and stuff like that. Also other couple little things that I noticed, just wanted to point out. We now have this uh, interesting cross ears on Bakito on our dragon. It doesn't seem like it does anything. So I don't know. I don't know how I feel about it. It's kind of, it's kind of annoying, but I guess it does better tell you where you're aiming. Yeah, it's, it's, I don't know, maybe I'd have to get used to it. Anyway, I'm going to bring Bikito with us just in case we need his assistance. Let's go ahead, though, and change his behavior to passive because I don't want to mess up any tames we have. And can I pick you up? Do I need to put on the new pickup matrix? Let's, let's hope this works. It's been a while, guys, since we played over here. All right, pickup matrix and pick up. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. All right, so Bikito's on her shoulder. I'm going to be rocking the Griffin. We probably don't need all this, but I, li I like having it. I like having it all. I like having a flyer. So anyway, I went through. How's everybody doing, by the way? Everybody doing well? All our dinos and creatures? Looks like they're all doing well. We've already caught basically, I think, everything worth catching in Extinction Core. Um, it also is worth noting, I did see, holy crud, look at, those are all the other villagers. Every episode I got a new tribesman. It is so laggy over there. Oh my goodness, we have our Titanosaurs, we have our Gigas, our Tech Gigas, all of our Bear, ooh, Giga Egg, Giga Egg, let's grab them. I wonder, we might be able to use these for a Basilisk. Just might, I don't know, they might be better. In Extinction Core, they absolutely might outdo a, uh, a Rock Drake. Maybe you'll grab a couple more of them. But, uh, yeah, there's there's a lot of stuff. We're probably not going to be able to cover it all today. And we'll have to see, based on what you guys say, if you want me to continue on from here for a little bit, just to go through all the update stuff, we can. Otherwise, we'll just start the new series and wait. But I had to check out some of this new stuff. Man, there's no eggs in there. There's no eggs in there. All right, anyway, those it's probably enough. It's probably good enough. All right, so first thing I wanna go check out is probably the feather light. Um, the primal feather light, I found one on the map. Not super crazy high level, but it's high enough. We're gonna be heading over to around 80-30. So I will meet you guys there. And it's just exciting to see where everything's gonna be located. You know, where are all the aberration things going to be? And there's also supposed to be a new tech creature somewhere roaming around the map that I don't believe is tameable. Oh, man. How I missed Extinction Core. How I missed you so very much. It's just so exciting. Ooh, look. Ooh. Oh, no. That's Bikito. Scared me for a second. Scared me for a second. Alpha Bronto. Oh, man. It's just so, so cool to reminisce. All right, anyway, um, carrying on, guys. I'll see you over at the Feather Light. All right, guys, we are over where the Feather Light should be. Primal Feather. Oh, I think that's it. I think that's it. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. Look at this. Look at how ginormous it is. Holy crud. What's attacking me? Oh, my goodness. Get out of here, brosy. Get out of here. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. I hope he's not mad at me. All right, so these guys, I believe, are passive tame only. And I believe you got to use the plant species. I think it said X. Yes. Do it. 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 Come here. Come here, Brosie. Come here. All right. Come on, Brosie. All right. Coming down. Coming down. Yeah. Got him. Dude, it just took one. That's crazy town. Wow. Look at this guy. Oh, he's so nifty. He's so nifty. Wow. That's not bad. All right, let's go ahead and do a whistle passive unfollow. Let's go on the Griffin and let's get really close and let's teleport back to the base. I want to check this guy out. DMAC base. Oh man, it's so cool already. And this weird pinkness that happens on the center map. I think one of the mods we have is causing that. All right, all right, all right. Baller town. 
And what does this guy eat after the fact? I, I can't remember what these guys eat, but not bad. We got a male, 569 after the tame. Wow, this, this is pretty cool. This is definitely pretty cool. I do dig him. All right, um, right, let's throw Bikito off her shoulder for a moment. Just momentarily so we can get all that dust out of the way. All that dust and grime that, you know, the the all the monkeys do. All right, very cool. So let's see, we can land, very nice. Let's see, we can, we have a head slot so we can actually put a helmet on this dude. That's pretty cool, why don't we go grab a helmet and put it on him? Be interesting to see if maybe, do, will our helmet work on him? Can we put on, no, you can't put on the prime armor, armor helmets. All right, good to know, good to know. Oh, do you hear the little sounds that he makes? It's so cool. All right, guys, super epic. I just put a flak helmet on him, and look at that. He can wear little costumes, too, just like we can. Oh, I love it. It's so very awesome. Uh-oh, are you too heavy, bro? All right, hold on. I just grabbed a whole bunch of giga eggs. Let's see if this guy can handle the weight. Um, just barely, just barely. It's just in case we run into a basilisk or something. All right, there you go. You hold on to that, brosy. Let me go on our feather light. I just want to see how this guy hits. And if, if he does hit, if he does attack. So we've got a left click. You can see right here. All right, right click. It does pretty much the same thing. I'm not really sure what the difference is. You can see the weight on him, though, is pretty high regardless. All right, can we find something that I can murder? It is beautiful, though. So majestic. Look at those colors come out. Let's see, let me gam up a little bit. Oh, it's so gorgeous. It's so gorgeous. All right, all right. Come here. I'm going to get him back down. All right, here we go. Here we go. Wow, look at it in comparison to a trike. It is pretty big. It is pretty big indeed. It definitely doesn't hit for much. The right click. What is that doing? If it was a pickup, it's too big to pick up, but it's definitely not doing anything. I think that's a baby trike, by the way. It's probably why it's so small. Come on, get your first kill, brosy. Oh, we got our first kill and it does harvest. That is so sweet. I press C, doesn't look like it's doing anything, and awesome, nothing. Can it attack on the ground? Can. Right click does nothing on the ground. C, X does nothing on the ground. All right, well, I dig this guy. I definitely dig him. It's it's pretty cool. Definitely pretty cool. And I did tell you to, uh, yeah, that's enabled. All right, huh. Let me, let me switch up. Can I do light on there? All right, let's see what happens when I hold him. Can I press the light thing? All right, clapped on. I can't really tell. It's too bright here anyway to see whether... Oh, no, no. It definitely is doing some sort of lighty thing. Definitely, like, very minimal, but it is. Uh-oh, I don't like that guy. Let's get the crap out of there. It's one of the things that steals stuff from you. All right, cool. So our first aberration creature, the awesome, awesome feather light. Very sweet. All right, let's go check out what the next guy is that we want to see we'll see what we run into first i'm not sure there is nameless on here i i doubt they're tameable but they are here so it's a possibility but yeah why don't we go check out some of the uh the rock drakes and stuff like that let's go check out that area i think that would be pretty gosh darn cool all right guys we're headed to 1270 to find the rock drakes and from the looks of things at least on here it's going to be on one of the volcano islands so we're at 70 now basically what we're going to be looking oh yeah 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 you can see them you can see them all right let's see if we can wreck their faces see how strong they are oh man annihilated annihilated all right i think i have her oh crap Crap, there's a lot of stuff there. I think I have harvesting resources turned off on this griffin right now. So we might want to turn it back on in case there's some type of drops that we want to get, which definitely could be a thing. Let's go ahead and say harvest settings, enable harvest resources. All right, very cool, very cool. Let's go check this out. There's a lot of bad shenanigans around here. So we definitely want to watch out. Ooh, look at all the, <gasps> there's a reaper. There is a reaper right there. You see it? You see it? Oh, man, there's two of them. 
Let's check them out. Reaper Kings. Oh, man, that's so cool. What do you think they'll give us? All right, let's see if we can annihilate them. Let's see if they're any big deal. Bam, bam, bam. Oh, my goodness. Dude. Get, wow, look at them all. Look at them all. Oh, my goodness. There's a lot of them there, brosie. Oh, man, I can't fly. I can't fly. Come on, hurry, hurry, hurry. Holy crap. Do you see them all? And that's a queen, I think, there, too. Hold on. Let's just check the levels. Now, this is interesting. It says there is an upgrade. Whoa. It says there's, like, a upgrade in order to get them or something like that on the on the taming sheet so i'm not exactly sure what that means i i really don't know so i don't know if i should kill these guys or try and tame these guys but i want to see what their levels are because there is right now a queen that's at level 600 on the server all right i can see something that's definitely a reaper right there can i can i see you pop out can you can you pop out can it be a thing? Oh, man. Look at There's a nameless, too. All right. It's right there. I'm kind of afraid, bro. I am, I'm seriously kind of afraid. All right. Let's just get this nameless. And remember, we don't have a glow pet with us. All right. There's the... Holy... Oh, oh, oh. My, my fingers cut off my keys. All right. Look at the queen. All right, that's a 240 queen. So even if that was something we wanted, that's not the one that I want. So why don't we hop off onto Bikido? Oh man, this is gonna be interesting. All right, I'm probably gonna have to do the pickup matrix on this dude again. Oh crap, I hope the queen can't get up here. All right, pick up. All right, what's going on? I'm hearing a lot of shenanigans. I'm hearing a lot of shenanigans. All right, let's go down. Let's start to wreck them. Let's start to wreck them. Let's see if we, what we get. Oh, and oh, dude, they can stand up to even Bakito's hits quite well. I might add. All right, we got Reaper stuff. Awesome. Holy crap! Look at that. That is definitely a queen. That is definitely a queen. If I ever seen one. Look at that tail. All right, we got pheromone glands. Oh man, this is awesome. And I like how it's just right out on the dead island. Oh my goodness, that is crazy town. All right, get wrecked. Yeah, look at how well they resist. So you definitely probably wanna have a glowy pet with you. All right, let's just look at these two things that we got. So we got normal reaper gland, okay. So that's from the Queen Reaper, and then these ones extracted from a Reaper King. Perhaps it has some use. Oh, mysterious, mysterious. All right, very cool. Anyway, let's run around here. Let's see. This is definitely where we'd also find potential Drake nests. Let's go ahead and wreck all these guys. Get wrecked, brosies. Wow, look at them all. Oh, my goodness. All right, we got a Black Tribe going on. Come on, kill the Black Tribe. Get wrecked. Dude, look at this. And these aren't even Alpha Reapers. These are normal Reapers. Good God. All right, luckily we have strong enough force with Bikido to, you know, even take them on. All right, we got Drakes. Nice, we get Drake Feathers there. Let's just take out the rest of this Black Tribe. Get wrecked. Notice they, they are hitting through the mount. Oh my goodness, another queen. Another queen. Get wrecked, queen. Oh my goodness. This is awesome, though. Seriously. And look at it. It's so hard to see the drakes. They're all hidden and such. Wow. I'm digging this. Ooh, hello. You're a beautiful Dodo Rexy. Let's go ahead and get a kill here. Just see. It might unlock something by killing them. If anything new has updated, nope, just element diamond and the such. That's fine with me. All right, let's 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 wreck all these guys now. All right, those are just normal tribes. Whoa, look at that stuff. Holy crud. It's been a while since I've been on here. It's just, it's so exciting to see everything. Oh my goodness. And Bikido's big moves, of course. I can't press R right now because I've got the griffin on my shoulder. It would throw out the griffin. 
Hello. Oh, there's more tribesmen. Let's let's handle them. Handle our business. Oh man, this is cool though. This is super cool. I'm just looking for what would be the Alpha Reaper. And to see what happens. That was another 220 queen. I'm not seeing any nests though. So somewhere around here we should see nests. So we're gonna have to peek around. We'll go over to the bigger volcano island and see what's up momentarily. Oh, Ravagers, look at all them. So they spawn over here too. Oh man, this is just so cool. This is so incredibly cool. Killed another queen, that was a 600 Reaper queen. Oh my goodness. So again, I don't know if I should be letting them like try and impregnate me. But either way, let's let's just get loot drops and everything that we can for the time being. Holy crud. And I'm curious to see what an alpha will look like. All right, so anyway, I'll see you guys back once something new happens. Goodness. All right, guys, next pretty awesome thing. So here is technic. Whoa. Uh-oh. Whoa. Whoa, Nelly there. All right, so we have technically what an alpha rock drake is. Check this guy out. Now, I don't believe he's tameable. I believe we have to wait for an egg or else we'll find a nest with an egg. But that is what an alpha rock drake looks like. So pretty cool. It might have some special type of drop. And then right here, this looks like it might be an alpha reaper of some sort. Wild alpha king reaper. So I, again, I am not precisely sure how you tame one of those, but that if there's one we're gonna tame, that would be the one we want. Absolutely, absolutely. So I'm gonna hang out, it's about to be nighttime. I'm gonna kinda bugger off a little bit and I just wanna look up a little bit more about these dudes. But man, are they cool. All right guys, wakey wakey, check it out. Got our first, first egg over here. Yeah, it just looks like they almost just like lay them. They just lay them, they just fall where they may. 600, beautiful. Oh my goodness, it <laughs> let me on. All right, they should all start to attack us, any ones that are around here. Oh man, that is super sweet. So that's all you gotta do is just hang out and wait. There's not really a nest, I, I guess. I do suppose they all come after me. Beautiful, and I'm noticing from a lot of these dudes, a lot of these uh, aberration guys, they actually will give you, you know, like all the mushrooms and stuff in drops, which is super duper handy. Um, I did have a basilisk come out during the night and attack me, which is kind of funny. And um, it actually laid an egg too, which is interesting. I don't think the egg's really used for much other than possibly a kibble. But look at that. Yeah, fertilized rock drake egg. I dig it. I dig it. So we can definitely get a rock drake already. Very, very nice. And then, of course, you get the tons of shenanigans in Extinction Core from all the bosses and whatnot that you kill. But anyway, um, I looked into the whole Reaper scenario a little bit further, and apparently, ooh, there's another egg, see? Yeah, don't even need a nest, they just generate. 360, all right, looks like we got pretty lucky with the egg that we got, the 600. There's a possibility that that is the max on the server. 600 is the max normal level of a creature in uh, Extinction Core. And look at that, Ravagers up the wazoo. So cool. I love it. And I did see an Alpha Ravager uh, during the night, but it was pretty low level. Um, ooh, look at this guy. Look at this guy. Um, we should probably want to kill him, if we can. If that could be a thing. Come here, brosy. All right, that may or may not hit him. Ooh. Dude, that totally looks like it was a hit, but he's not turning around. So, the deal with the Alpha Reapers is you actually gotta kill them and they'll give you a special drop, which you'll then wanna use if we can find them. But you can get a normal Reaper from, oh crap, what level is this queen? All right, level 100. If you get impregnated, I guess, and get a normal Reaper, like a Reaper King, you can then upgrade that Reaper King into an Alpha King. So that's how that works. Now I'm a little, I have a little bit of question of whether we're gonna be able to take on an Alpha King without having a glow pet. 
just because of the amazing, insane resistance. I mean, look at this. This isn't even an alpha reaper. That's a normal reaper. And it's that hard to kill. So, yeah, go figure. Go figure. Let's just hope for the best with Paquito. I mean, it is Paquito. We, we should be able to handle it. Now, where is this dude? We got to get him to come out. I know we saw him mo uh, a second ago. We saw him, like, during the night. We just got to wait for him to come out. I don't know whether he goes under the ground or, or what. But he's around here somewhere. So I'll cut back in once I find the Alpha Reaper. Let's kill him. Let's get the upgrade. That would be sick. Oh, by the way, um, from the uh, TLC patch, um, all that stuff's in Extinction Core and fixed. Look at that. There's a new beautiful, beautiful looking Rex. Yeah, definitely a different look to it. It's pretty nifty. I do dig them. Whoa, what the crap is that? Look at that thing. Holy crap, what is that thing? Oh my goodness. You, oh, that's the Alpha Reaper. That is the Alpha Reaper. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. All right. It looks like it summons in little Reaper minions. Oh my goodness. All right. Let's wreck its face. It doesn't seem to be hitting through the mount. All right. Reaper minion. All right. We definitely can't tame a minion. This is good to know. All right, how are we doing on this guy? All right, it's a 600. It's already halfway done. Come here, brosie, get dead, get dead. It's gorgeous looking though. Look at that beautiful Reaper. Alpha Reaper, baby. That is so cool. Oh, I can't wait to get one of these. And we got another minion. Come on, brosie, what's he doing? Oh. All right, let's, let's run a little bit from him. I just want to see him. I just want to look at him. I just want to look at his face. Look at those minions. Oh, man, they're so nasty. Oh, man, he summons in a crap load of minions. Look at you, bro. Look at you. You are so cool, Alpha Reaper. Oh, my goodness. So very cool. So let's see what happens when we kill this guy. What will unlock? You can see he's super duper hurt right now. Super duper hurt. Almost gone. Almost dead. Let's go, Bakito. You can do this. You can do it. Kill the Alpha Reaper. Almost done. I'm very happy. Very pleased I can do this without a lighty pet. Oh my goodness. Come on. Come on. And. All right. Alpha Reaper's been defeated. I did not notice anything unlock. I did not notice anything unlock, and I did not notice anything new get put into my inventory uh oh uh oh all right what could this have unlocked something let's let's type in re it should have unlocked this right here why it did not unlock that right there i have no clue i have no clue why that did not happen that that's that's what people were saying though that should have unlocked that Oh, I'm going to be so paved. Why did that not unlock? It just don't make no sense to me. No sense at all. All right. Super rainy. We got a giga. Let's just go wreck its face. Just see. Unlock anything? Nope. Nothing. Yeah, so I'm just not getting it. Maybe we got to tame a reaper first before it will unlock. I, I don't know. I don't know. Usually if something doesn't lock, unlock an extinction core, it's because there's some prerequisite that you need to unlock first. So this I just do not know. We do have an alpha um, rock drake around here. I want to go hang out over by him just to see if it's going to lay an egg. I don't know if it's something we should kill first to get the egg or if we just hang out. So I'm going to run around. I'm going to see what's up. But most of the new stuff all spawns in right over here on the Volcano Island. For at least the center map. So I would assume that would be equivalent to the dead island on the uh, the normal volcano map, the island. Yeah, that I mean, that would make sense. That would definitely uh, make a sense. Get wrecked, brosies. Get wrecked. Oh my goodness. So much good stuff, though, over here. I got several Dota Rex kills. I got a Dota Wyvern kill. Tons of goodies, tons of goodies. All right, guys, I've been hanging around this rock drake for a while and I'm not seeing any eggs pop out from it. It is a male though, so I do suppose it's possible maybe if it has, if it's actually being laid. 
that it might not be able to if it's a male or maybe there has to be two of them i don't know but i want to smash it and just see what it gives us all right so it gives us just like what any other alpha would give us nothing too crazy dude get out of here all right so we got tons of good stuff definitely i'm really disappointed that that alpha reaper didn't unlock anything though that is my biggest disappointment for sure for sure but i think we should probably get back to the base and um start looking at some other stuff i've gone around this whole island it's pretty much just rock drakes and reapers there actually i think is another rock drake another alpha rock drake somewhere around here so i'm gonna go hunting for a moment but i likely will meet you back at the base all right guys back at the base and i think i want to go check out an alpha crab next however really quickly really quickly let's go ahead and remember i said this guy could generate stuff while on wander let's go find out i just remembered that we can hitch this guy to the hitching post while we put him on wander and he won't wander away on us which is going to be important so let's go ahead is our hitch dino do you see it there it is hitch dino awesome and then let's go ahead and can we enable wander? It would be under behavior, right? Behavior, uh-oh. Oh no. Oh no. Looks like we got a crash. Dang it! Oh man, that stinks. All right, so we're okay. Didn't lose anything. I'm not sure what caused that crash. Second time that happened to me today, but don't know, don't know. Anyway, I've got the prime feather light. It's linked up, it's on wandering. And we'll see if over time it generates uh, any of the balls or anything like that. But that should make the uh, congealed gas balls. So we'll see. We will see what happens. I don't even know for sure if it's based on being on Wander. But hopefully that's what it is. Anyway, let's grab Bakito. Gotta have that Bakito backup. If we run into something super crazy. Let's go grab our Alpha Griffin. And um, let's go check out. Let's go see the crab. I found one, I located one that's pretty decent level, and I'm just hoping that we can knock it out with the Trank stuff. It is a knockout tame, it's just whether it's with cannonballs and such. So this I don't know. Oh, and you know what else? There's, oh, I almost forgot about this. There is an Omega that's on the server, which I've never seen an Omega before. Ooh, and there's also this super epic trike right here. Let's go take him on real quick. Let's go wreck his face and let's go get that Omega too. It's an Omega brood mother. So once again, I've never, whoa. All right, just a bunch of ants, nothing to worry about, nothing to worry about. Let's go pick this guy up. Let's -a go find out what's up with that Omega dude. I've never killed one before, so I don't know. Anyway, let's get this trike. It's a tech trike. This would normally unlock, I believe, the tech shield. I, I believe is what its deal is. All right, almost done. Super simple fight. Awesome, we got a bionic costume for it. Pretty cool. All right, let's go find uh, those two things. All right, guys, check it out. Omega Broodmother. This is not something new, but this is something I have never personally seen before. They just weren't spawning in on the servers before when we were last playing. They were a thing, they just weren't. Oh my goodness, all these dumb bugs. Hold on. Let's kill all the bugs. I want to be able to have nobody on my shoulder. Gotta do Bikido with nobody so we can use that epic R button. And then we just fly up and get our griffin. Alright, let's go ahead. Let's warm up on this other brood mother. This should be pretty gosh darn epic. Oh my goodness. And then Basilisk do spawn in here too. Alright. Warmed up, Bikido. Warmed up. Oh my goodness, look at all the shenanigans you got just from that. Goodness. All right, here we go. Omega Broodmother. Oh man, I don't know what to expect. I do not. Oh my goodness, hello, Brosy. Get wrecked. All right, got your scale. All right, let's annihilate this guy. Bam. Oh my goodness, that doesn't do nearly as much as I hoped. All right, it's not hitting through the mount, which is cool. But this is a pretty crazy fight. Oh my goodness. All right, Paquito, do your big slam. Wow, this guy really can hold his own. Resist the crap out of us. All right, got him down the halfway. Again, not hitting through the mount. That was the biggest thing I was worried about. 
All right, go ahead, Bikido, do your big slam. Wow, this guy is awesome looking. Let's see, can we get a nice zoomed out look at him? It's like all kind of like translucent looking. It is super crazy looking. Spawns in 1,200 spiders. Oh, good lord. All right, big slam. All right, almost done. Almost a thing. We got this, our first Omega kill of the season. Oh my goodness, we just die. Wow. Oh man, that is so cool. Dude, look at that. All right, and it doesn't look like we can harvest the body. I can look inside to see if there's anything else as far as loot drops, but that looks like it's about it. Let's take a look real quick in our inventory. Wow, so it gave us the Gamma Broodmother Trophy. It gave us an Alpha Broodmother Trophy. Omega Costume. Oh, man, that's super cool. So we can make our Broodmother look like an Omega. And then it gave us, so it gave us all three of the uh, the heads. That is super duper nifty. I totally dig that. And let's just see in the body, access inventory. All right, nothing in it, and it doesn't look like it's something we can harvest. Nope, nothing, nothing. Wow, that is so super cool. I've never seen one before. All right, let's go get our griffin. Oop, oop. Come here, come here. Come here, I said. Let's go get our griffin. Let's go find this other dude. Let's go find this alpha crab, and let's see if we can tame it. I only have 25 arrows, though. Arrows are much more expensive nowadays. Much more expensive to craft. So, unfortunately, I don't think we're going to be able to craft anymore, at least... I'm hoping we don't have to. What's going on down here? Oh, maybe the tribe shenanigans? I don't know. All right, let's go find this crab. All right, guys, there it is. Check it out, male alpha. 600 would be the highest level possible to get. Let's see if we can get this guy out of here. Oh man, awesome alpha glow. Totally, all right, he's following us. All right, that's a thing. Oh my goodness. We gotta be a little careful about all the shenanigans around here. Oh lordy, so the question is, can we knock him out like a normal creature or do we have to use the, the crazy shenanigans to do it? All right, so, so, let's see. Let's get our normal trank rifle out. All right, and let's first try and normal trank him and then we can kind of check out what's going on. All right, can't shoot underwater. Let's see if I can nail him just like this. Let's see if we can get a hit in on him. All right, all right. We definitely got a hit of some sort. Did that do any torpor? I'm not seeing any torpor. And he didn't really get aggroed at us. Yeah, no torpor whatsoever. I mean, that's not... This, this doesn't do all that much. But I just have the, the sneaking suspicion that we might be able to do it with the uh, the special Anunnaki darts. I'm just trying to get this guy aggroed to come up at me. All right, all right. Come on, keep on getting peeved at Paquito, bro. Just keep it up. All right, perfect. All right, awesome, awesome. This is exactly what we want. All right, now let's switch up to our other arrows. Let's see if this works. Oh, please work. Please be a thing. All right, we're probably still going to have to hit him directly in the head. All right, all right. Oh, no. All right, let's just see if that worked. No, I'm not seeing any torpor on him. Oh, dang it. All right, we can still maybe get a good shot on him. Come on, let me. I don't want to waste my arrows. I'm trying to get him, because remember the rock golems we can get with this guy. Oh my goodness, this is so unbelievably awkward to do. Oh my goodness. Wasting all my arrows. Yeah, we're probably going to end up dying. I just, I got to see if any of those did anything. Nothing. Nothing. All right, how do we get out of this is the better question. This is the better question. Is there a way to get out of this without killing the crab? Because this is an awesome level one. We don't want to kill it, but man, that is so cool. Alpha crab that is tameable if we, if we have the correct equipment to do such. 
to do it. Oh lordy. Um, yeah, this is bad news. This is a bad news. Definitely, bro, bad news. All right, I regrouped myself just a little bit and I just came up with genius, two genius ideas of how we could do this. A, we might be able to knock it out using another tech dude. It's not like only Drake's work with it. So this could definitely be a thing. And then B, we might be able to passive tame in it you, because it is an alpha using the alpha helmet. I mean, we're basically max level. So we're as high as you can get. I would say there's a decent chance that we'll be able to knock it out. At least in one of these two ways or just passive tame it. It takes turtle kibble. The other thing would be a golden tree, but I have no golden tree. So nothing we could do about that. We can try, we'll, we'll try the passive tame though. We'll try that next. All right, so there it is. There's our alpha crab. Let's go park our guys just a little little ways off over here, perhaps. Just to, just to hope and make sure that they're safe. Let's throw them both there. Oop, Paquito, get off. Let's make sure they're both on passive. Let's throw on our alpha helmet. Let's get our turtle kibble in the last slot. And let's just see what happens. Let's see if this can be a thing. If I can passive tame them. Oh, crap. Yeah. No, 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 you go down. All right, I don't know what other stuff's around here. This is the only sketchy part, and also how long it's going to take to tame, but he doesn't seem to see us, which is cool. Can I passive tame you, bro? I'm not seeing the passive tame meter thing go up. Oh, oh, he sees us. No, it was something else. It was something else. It was a turtle. All right. Can I, I'm not seeing the passive tame meter go on him. I'm, I'm not seeing it, so it doesn't look like... It said that we should be able to, but I guess not. I guess I'm not. All right, so on that note, let's grab Bikito. Pick up. Let's grab our Tapara. Let's switch. I guess it wouldn't be a bad thing to keep this helmet on, at least for now. And let's start to nail him. Did you did you get your little your little thing out, buddy bro? Ooh, ooh, I gotta... Oh. Uh-oh. How am I doing? Is is my st okay? He's got plenty of stamina. All right, we got to get our tech thing out. All right, awesome. Let's see if that did any torpor. Uh oh, I'm not seeing any torpor, bro. All right, I mean we're hitting them. We're getting the hits in on them. This is going to be very frustrating if this is not a way that we can tame him. Oh, crap. That was definitely a leg hit. We just got to get enough so that we can ensure that we're getting body hits, but no torpor, and his health is is basically full. I could craft a new helmet just in case. Oh, my goodness. All right. I mean, that those are all looking like body hits. He's definitely, he's afraid of us. He, he don't know what to think. All right, those those are definitely body hits. And nothing. Oh no! Makes me so mad, so mad. All right, back to the drawing board. Back to the drawing board. How are we gonna do this? All right. One thing that came to mind is the tech saddle that my Tapar is wearing. I think it's from the tech bench. It's not the vanilla one, which definitely would be the ideal one to use. But apparently, we haven't unlocked it yet. So that's interesting. This is very interesting, but the next interesting thing is, look at this. Let's see, Drake. Um, learn on aberration. Okay, tech. No, we can make a Rock Drake tech saddle. This is so weird. Why can we make that? How is that different than this? What in the crap? I don't know how we have that unlocked, but not unlocked there. But apparently that's a thing. So maybe we should just hatch out one of these Drake eggs. Maybe that should be a thing. Let's see how we have for Nameless Venom. Um, We should have enough to, to get a Drake fully done. So why don't we grab one of our, our 600 Drake egg? I mean, that would be cool at least. Let's see. To get something done for today. Definitely, definitely. Let's go to our hatchery, which is over here. Are you turned on? All right, it's it's it should be on. Let's go ahead throw this egg out. 
activate. All right, it picked up the egg. Let's do this, let's hatch out the egg. I think that would be pretty cool so we can at least get one of the uh, the new creatures. And let's also see, how's uh, here, Brosie? Um, there's also the uh, tech saddle for the Rex. So that could be another interesting thing to try. Oh man, look at that, that is awesome. And it's getting all the congealed balls. Oh, baller town, baller town. So that's gonna be how we probably get those resources. I don't think there's any nodes that have been put in. Um, there's also the shine horns, but I haven't seen any of those spawn in, but those get all the gemstones, which we will need if we wanna make a saddle. Definitely, so yeah, we'll look into that. All right, guys, I believe our Drake is ready. Our first Drake, this is gonna be pretty cool. Of course, it's not an alpha Drake, but hey, I will settle for this type of Drake. And, and, come on, baby. Come on, incubating one, and here we go. ba bam -y. Oh, man, you look so glitched out right now. All right, oh, there we go. Beautiful looking one, nice blues. Let's go ahead, throw in that, and then our auto feeder should feed them everything that it needs. Oh, and it's a female, very nice. I dig it. All right, let's go ahead, do the behavior stance. Let's change it to passive. And um, let me see, is there anything else? Behavior, disable, wandering, unfollow. Beautiful. And then our little nanny should imprint on it. Very nice. As time passes. So we shouldn't even have to imprint on it. But in case we want to, it's going to be in an, a little over an hour. Wow. That's kind of a long time. I think the nanny will take care of you, little buddy. What a beauty. What a beauty. I love it. I love it. So I went and I checked. There's no more shine horns that I can find on the server right now. So a little unfortunate. We'll, we'll see what happens. We will see what happens. But I just don't know what to do about this crab. Um, you guys, why don't you tell me in the comments what we can do. But we got a baby Drake that is super awesome. We got take on. Oh, we didn't even get to try it yet. We didn't even get to try it. Let's go try it real quick. Our awesome new costume. I'm I'm willing to bet you this new costume will even work on our, let's see if it works on our tech spider. This, this would be interesting to know. Will it work? No, no costume slots. All right, good to know. So we gotta use it on a vanilla one. Or not a vanilla one, but you know what I mean. A normal brood mother, which we do have somewhere in here. Normal brood mother. Where are you? Where do you hang out? I know we got one. Do you guys see it? Oh, there it is. There it is. There she be. We got all the most baller ones. I think we definitely have a perfect one. But bammy. Awesome looking brood mother anyway. Anyway. But gamma. Oh, that's so much cooler. Look at that. Oh, wow. Wow, wow, wow. So we got a gamma brood mother now. That is super duper cool looking. It's so it's it very it's very different, very unique. I dig it. I love it. Awesome Gamma Broodmother. Totally cool. All right, but I'm not gonna leave the costume on you because I want to put it in one of my safes. <gasps> I can't take the costume off once I put it on. Oh, are you equipping this costume permanently changes? Cannot un oh. Dang it, I wish I checked that. I wish I looked. Hopefully this is a, the most perfect brood mother, but I'm pretty sure it is. Pretty sure it is. All right, well, cool nonetheless. That's so weird that you can't take off the costume. All right, well, we got a permanent gamma brood mother. I dig it. I love it. All right, guys. Well, I think we did pretty good today and at least checking out you know, the surface of the update. Once again, we got to see an Alpha Drake, Alpha Reaper. We got to see an Alpha Crab. None of them tames, but we will try our dangdest. We hatched out a Drake. We took on the Gamma Boss. It's it's pretty, pretty gosh darn cool. We got to see Nameless. We got to tame a, um, what, what, the, what are they called? Primal uh, Featherlight. It's pretty darn cool. It really is. So I'm really liking this update. As I said again, I'm going to be starting probably within the next week a new series starting Extinction Core from the beginning. I want to know though, would you like to see me do any more of this series, this world before I move on to that or should we just get it going with it? 
Um, I should still be doing Pugnacia, and I haven't finished that series yet, so don't bug out about that. Do not. But it, this new Extinction Core series will be taking over ultimately, ultimately, because you know how much I love Extinction Core, and hopefully you get 100 episodes out of that. Anyway, guys, thank you all so much for watching. Help me out with any tips and tricks about any of these new creatures. Some of the stuff might just be bugs that get patched. Who knows? But I want to know, how do we get that Alpha Reaper thing unlocked? Because we killed it and it didn't unlock it. I just don't know. Do not know in any other cool stuff. Also, I'd like to hear, what map would you like me to do? The new Extinction Core. And I'm thinking Crystal Isles. Because Crystal Isles has a bunch of new updates. You can take on all the different bosses. Including, I believe, Rockwell. At least that should be a thing. So that sounds pretty cool to me, but let me know what you think in the comments below. Anyway, guys, till next time, thank you oh so much for watching. Please remember, show that amazing support by slamming that thumbs up button. If you're new to the channel, do not forget to subscribe for the daily arc awesomeness. And as always, guys, I'll see you tomorrow. Thanks again and peace.